we are, season one, episode three. We're in Oakland County this morning at Southline, Michigan. We're at Tanglewood Golf Course. Mark, what do you think about this? I think Tanglewood's fantastic. I've played her many, many years. I actually won my golf league the first year I played it, so I've mean, got some really good memories. I hosted a couple golf outings here from work. It's a really nice course. Three nines, definitely challenging for varying levels of you know what your skill level is. Um, I've shot anywhere from a 40 to a 60 here, and I think that has much to do about how bad I am. It has to do with uh, the different tees that they offer. So $35 for nine holes, I think it's 59 for 18, so it's a good price. Uh, really nice course if you look around and then do like the panoramic uh, view, it's really pretty. Um, so yeah, should be a fun day. I believe this first hole is a 440 yard par four. Tough way to start the morning, but really it's, again, there's some tough holes, some challenging holes, and this course definitely has something for everyone. Um, I think I'd say if you come out here and play, it's not too challenging. I mean, the biggest thing is some of the holes are long, so you just keep the ball on the fairway, and uh, should be good. Mark's on the green. We actually have an extra um, golfer with us that got assigned to us, a third guy. He probably thinks we're a couple of weirdos here. He doesn't know what we're doing. We keep taking our uh, phones out and talking and everything else. So we might have to let Dan in on what's going on. But right now, uh, you know, we'll see how it goes. So it's a little bit of a slow start with the weather and with the group of us. Keep you posted. Right, what do you think so far? Uh, I think it's a nice course. I mean, I feel, uh, I mean, all courses are probably out of my league, but this is really, I think, uh, this is really nice a, I feel like a fish out of water big time here. This is the nicest one we've played so far in our yeah. little series, but uh, sure. only going to get better. I just wish the weather would have been there. Um, they really. I can't say enough about how much I like this place. It's pretty awesome. Yeah. If I can finish today without Dan punching me in the face, it's a good day. I think I can say the same for both of us, so do lean out, buddy. Okay, here we go. There we Next go. hole. We lost Mark's black ball. South Lion to Cattails to Unit St. John's to Mystic Creek League is definitely a little more challenging. Definitely right? a step up for sure. Yeah. Absolutely. It's a nice course. A lot of fun so far. The weather sucks though. Yep. All right, guys, hole four coming up. Being your thought process every time you hit a ball. Okay. Every time. I'll keep working on it. had 11 subscribers and 69 viewers of our uh, Cattails review. 11 of those subscribers too, Mark. They range from Canada to Mexico to India. So we're are you already kidding? the eyes of the world are on there. I think it's incredible. And I think one thing to point out too is that the uh, fairways are really wet and the uh, golf carts, like you, know, you can spin them in the fairways, which is always fun if you're very immature. Like, <laughs> Some people are. So. All right. All right. Go ahead and hit Lee. Oh. I think we've given Dan some comedy for the first uh, two hours here, and uh, you're going to miss us in the back nine, aren't you, Dan? Driving means you appears to be right behind us back there. So note to self, don't spend a lot of time on the seventh fairway because you may die. Oh my 
my worst fear is, Mark, to be honest? You know how if you write a bad check on a store that you put your check up sometimes behind the thing? Or pitch I'm worried they're going to put my picture up and turn the counter on the place and then we'll be back in. <laughs> I had seven strokes just on the green mark on that last one. Uh, are you having fun or does it really matter? I'm having fun now that I know that Dan's not going to kill us or anything. He seems to be yeah, in Dan is laughing at how stupid we are. I think so too. <laughs> He's a guest hacker. Guest hacker. So let's see what we do on number nine. All right. See you in a minute, guys. Dan, have you seen anybody worse than me? Oh, yeah. Oh. Plenty of people. Oh, thank you. This is a compliment. Dan Golfing here. Dan's put up the, with the two of us idiots this whole time, so fortunately he's in good spirits. Hey, look at that. Best one of the day. We're just finishing up uh, Tanglewood Course, getting the cart back in its place and uh, wrapping up. But I tell you, I'm, uh, I'm eager to get back out on the course. I'm eager to start episode four and improve my play. Definitely, uh, today was an eye opener for me to just, just realize just how really bad I am. You know, but, but the biggest thing is that you got to play. And I mean, if you play, you, you practice and you get better. If you sit there and go, I'm terrible, you never get better. Just play. Look at this. There's just one thing to point out. Look how nice the guy here. Beautiful. Beautiful. Guys, a little, little golf course. Worth coming out to. If you ever want to have an outing, the banquet hall downstairs is great. Um, affordable, 59 bucks for 18 holes on a Sunday morning, which is a really nice price. So um, I'd say I'm going to give it an eight and a half. And again, this isn't like a top 10 course, but I mean, for the money, if you, it's, it's worth the drive, wherever you're driving from. This is kind of, you know, far from most people on the east side of Metro Detroit, but worth coming out to. Check it out, guys. Keep watching and keep subscribing. All right, guys, till next time, we're out.